welcome back to my youtube channel hi how are you doing i hope you're doing good i'm doing amazing if you're new here hello my name is queen now you know what to do go hit that subscribe button go hit that notification bell so that you're notified anytime i have a new upload like right now okay also like share comment do all the good stuff shout out to everyone who has watched my weight loss video guys that video has the highest uh, views so far. I think it was like at 502 the last time I checked. I'm really happy. Thank you so much. Also, a big thank you to all my new subscribers. You guys have made me so emotional this past week because I've just been seeing the numbers going up and I'm like, thank you, Jesus. My tiny, tiny, tiny little channel is growing all thanks to you. So yeah, my heartfelt thanks, gratitude to everyone who is supporting my journey so far all right yeah beauties let's get into today's glam um as you can see i have my wig on i laid it down i got this one from geekhair.ke on instagram i'm gonna leave all the descript the details in the description box then my coat of many colors i'm really loving this tree jacket when i saw it i was obsessed immediately it's from blazer254 on instagram check them out as well they usually have amazing amazing blazers that's where i buy and then they're thrifted meaning they're all unique pieces then this top that i'm wearing inside the turtleneck is just it's a random buy one of those random buys square streets yeah then i paired it with this gold um little chain and some gold loops um, and if you can't tell i'm going for that 90s style how our moms used to dress 80s you know the shoulder pads um though the jacket in itself is big this is big it's like xl and i'm a size small but i wanted that oversized look you get what i mean let me actually stand up so that you guys can see i paired it with this leather skirt and if i was to wear it like if i was going outside then this would have been the look i love the gold the gold detailing with some heels and you look it snatched yeah so <laughs> check them out blazer 254 they have really good blazers all settled then also last but not least my nails i got them done on friday last week and i got them done at mo nailed it and i really love it we went with a bright color once again i don't know who i am anymore but i'm just going with the flow can't complain yeah we did this green to match my engagement ring and i love it i love it Whew. your intro imetosha now go get something to drink go get comfortable or if you're somewhere where you're walking fika kwa nyumba kwanza all right and then let's continue with this video so as you've seen by the title of this video beauties today i'll be talking about how i got to be a model or rather a face of nivea um because it's a question that so many beauties have been asking me both like you know ordinary day-to-day -day women doing other careers and aspiring models so i just thought you know let me sit and see what what i can share with you guys because i want to keep it real um i don't want to get anyone's hopes up or hopes down so this is gonna be a very real video where i just share with you how the process came about and how i ended up doing this job um for those ones who are new to my face so i'm kenyan um i'm a professional fashion model and a commercial model and just the other day i unveiled my beauty campaign with nivea um made for um, west africa market central africa market and east africa market yeah so this project was actually shot last year late last year um and it's very special to my heart because working for nivea has been a lifelong dream for me ever since i was a little child i love this brand i've been using it i believe many people have been using nivea in their homes since we were babies so for me especially when i was growing up and i was practicing how to be a model i used to look at tv adverts a lot you know and i remember all the nivea adverts when we were young they were so captivating they were so you know like the way the movement the music all of that i used to just 
daydream and see myself being a Nivea model. So it's a prayer point that I've had for a very long time before I even knew how to wear heels, just to give you the background into the story. Um, and then with my modeling career, um, I don't know whether I'm gonna film another video where I get into details about my modeling career, uh, maybe, but just a short background. Um, I've always worked with an agency when it comes to my big jobs, what I would call big jobs. And then the small everyday jobs, I normally just get them for myself. But I remember my agent calling me and she told me, hey, Lynn, so we have a client who is interested in working with you as a model. You've been shortlisted. There's still a list of, you know, the, the, the list is big um, with other models included, of course. But I just wanted to let you know so that you can be on, on your toes, like be on the lookout, like don't go anywhere, don't change your plans, stuff like that. So at first, I didn't know which company this was. So I was just like, okay. I'm excited, yes, at the prospect of a new job, but I didn't imagine in my wildest dreams that it would be Nivea. So um, I remember my agent calling me again, I think it was after a day or two, and letting me know that I've been shortlisted yet again. This is now the final list, and what is needed is that each model will make a short video about themselves, um, just like an intro video where you talk to people and let them know who you are. They want to see your personality. They want to see you doing an activity that you like, you know, maybe a hobby, but it's supposed to be very authentic, no madoido, one minute video. So I remember my brother was home at that time. Um, it was actually a very difficult time for me, you know? Yeah, so my father had just passed away and we had like school fees arrears at that time. Um, of quite a, a considerable amount of money um i'll not share how much but you can you can imagine at that time i was really stressed out there were a lot of things going on in my life so just the fact that there's a there's a job that's coming up even if i've not yet been picked even if i don't know whether i'm gonna get the job i was just happy to see that there's something good that's coming my way like i was just choosing to hold on to that positivity so I remember her hanging out with my brother in the house and I told him, hey bro, so I've been shortlisted for this modeling job and they and they want us to make a video um, of us just expressing ourselves, who we are and what we're doing, uh, what we do with ourselves like every day to day life. So got the Uber, we went to Kabura Forest with my brother. So we're just scouting for locations within the forest where we can take nice pictures. And then we found like a nice spot where the sunlight was just, you know, pouring into the forest. Yeah, it was really nice. And my brother was like, yes, Mama Apo. So he is the videographer this whole time and we're using my phone. So when we got um, the good spot, then um, I did my thing. He took a couple of pictures of me as well. Um, then we went back home. So as much as I'm excited, guys, I'm not even thinking in my head that this is Nivea. I'm not even thinking in my head that there is any chance of me being picked as the final choice, you know. So I'm just doing it because I'm committed to the journey. But to be honest, in my head at that time, I wasn't even imagining that this is something that could actually go through. So I come back home and I remember I was so stressed out because my brother was supposed to go back to school. And I had no idea where I was going to get the funds to clear off the balance. Hey, guys. Woo! Same as stress. I was really stressed at that. I was really stressed out, but I was praying to God that I get a breakthrough one way or the other so that, you know, my brother can be okay and even for me so I can take care of myself and take care of my family. You know what I mean? Yeah. So my agent calls me and she tells me, Hey, Lynn. Hi. So guess what? I'm like, what? You've been chosen for the job. And I couldn't believe it. I, I was like, wait, what? me i got it and she's like yes you you are the final pick <laughs> I, I, I was crying i was praying I, I i remember going down on my knees and just uh, just started praising god and crying i called my mom i was screaming i was so excited because i really couldn't believe and by this time my brother has gone back to school and we had spoken to the school administration and we explained to them our situation and they were so understanding they were so kind they were like no 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 i'm a lynette lynette don't worry about it uh your brother is gonna stay in school look for the funds we really understand you know what you've been going through as a family don't have any pressure just pay off the school fees in installments until we finish it you guys 
god the way god works because i remember being so happy i couldn't imagine the favor that was working with us because something like that is unheard of you know and then coming back to nairobi after taking my brother to school and the next day my agent calls me and tells me that i've gotten the job and not just any job but a beauty campaign for nivea the nivea company or rather the nivea brand you guys and this has been something i've been praying to god to bring my way ever since i knew what modeling was ever since i was a young girl walking around the house painting my face with my mom's makeup and trying to be a model from what i was seeing on tv nivea has always been a dream of mine and here it is and god is delivering it at a very trying time in my life when i really needed that hand that that show of that sign that god is here with you lynette that show of calm down my daughter i'm here with you and i know what's going on and i'm preparing a way where there's no way no connections no nothing i didn't know somebody who told me to do this or pay them or no i wasn't connected by a friend or a friend of a, no this was legit i say legit miracle directly done by god for me and my family because we really needed a good we, we really needed good news at that time we had just been suffering losses left right and center and i just needed something that would bring back that hope that happiness that fire to continue with the journey so after my celebrations and everything i also called my fiance and i told him you know and he was so happy he was so excited um at the time we were still girlfriend and boyfriend we had not yet gotten engaged we got engaged this year in january so we had not yet gotten engaged so he was still my boyfriend so let me say boyfriend back then and he was so happy for me and i thank him for that yeah so beauties i remember uh, not getting the details uh because we created a whatsapp group or rather a whatsapp group was created um where now all the cast members were added to the group and now we were given the breakdown of the job and finding out that the job was actually for a new product that is the perfect and mat and that the ad was gonna run in west africa central africa and east africa and then looking at the figure that they were paying me i was just shouting and praising god beauties like i was just shouting and praising god because it was an answered prayer that came in at the right time that's all i'm gonna say i was livid i was shook i couldn't believe it i was shaking as like me me you know and then at that time i hadn't yet gotten my braces i had not yet gotten my braces so you see your fears the things that you're scared about the things that you feel like are wrong with you at the time so i was just looking at myself in the mirror i'm like oh my god uh, how are they gonna view me is everything gonna go well is my skin looking good is my smile all right you know and having misaligned teeth at the time and crossbites i was just like this is such a huge brand like i hope they don't see me and say no but then my mom is there like mm. Asha ujinga, si wamesha ona video yako, wamesha ona picha yako na hizo ndo vitu zimefanya wamekupatia kazi na umekuwa ukiomba Mungu wako kila siku. Si uambie Mungu asante na ushikilie baraka, wacha kuogopa, jamini. So yeah guys, I was I, I was so nervous, you know? Yeah, cuz this is like your dream client and you've gotten the job and now you want to deliver cuz you want to do a beautiful thing that you're always going to remember for the rest of your life, yeah? Pressure, pressure. Hey. Hmm. Anyway, we were given the dates. Um, and luckily, the models, the other models that um we we're gonna do the ad with, are people that I knew, people that I was comfortable with. So it was almost kind of like a hangout. Um, yeah. And I remember the crew was so helpful uh, with the directions, with you know the hair, the makeup, the wardrobe. Um, everything was so well done and so well thought out i was just learning so much and half the time i was in awe of everything to be honest because it was like a dream that has been removed from your head and now it's there you're you're you're, you're in the dream but it's real 
but you can't help but step back and look at it from a third person's pers perspective and be like yo yo you guys yo yo you mean this is my name you mean you mean this is my name on this product you mean that it's 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 it's, it's me who has been casted for this thing so it was really it was the happiest moment of my life honestly that and the day i was engaged of course yeah but career wise that was the highest point of my career in my <laughs> i don't even know what to say i can't speak properly guys because that's just how i was feeling but then standing there and actually doing that job that's when i started remembering the prayers the things my mom would tell me the 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 preparation that I had been putting in since 2020 you know the dropping the excess weight taking care of my skin the yoga the praying the running like i started seeing how every single thing that i had been doing from two years ago had brought me to that moment and i was in awe of god and how he does his things and how he plans his things and just seeing this campaign come to life and seeing everything you know like the final results and the posts the ads the on, on youtube i'm not used to it you guys like i could be watching a vlog on youtube and then the advert comes in and it's me and <sighs> even now when i'm talking you guys can tell i'm so excited because it was the one thing that i really really wanted in my life and i dreamt about it since i was a young child and a part of me never thought that it would come true but a part of me for sure believed that i had it in me and god also came in at the right time and did his things um but from the technical point of view if you're a lady who wants to pursue modeling professionally then you have to take yourself seriously and that would mean register with a credible agency take proper pictures of yourself um but most importantly, I would say be authentic. Stay true to who you are. Your flaws and the things that you may think are wrong with you are exactly the things that are going to put you out there. I've come to see that God makes us uniquely for a reason. And sometimes you may think like, oh my, like for me, my personality is quite big if you meet me in person um i'm an introvert like i do not like being around many people and if i go somewhere where there are many people like today i'll need like two three days by myself to recharge and recover but if i'm comfortable around you then i have a very big personality you know and there were times in my younger years where i would feel like i was too much or people would tell me you're too much or you're too this you're too this tone down you're too animated or your face looks like how your height is like this or your mouth is like that or i've had all these kind of things come at me um throughout the journey but I strongly believe that it was those very same features, it was that very same personality that won these people over. I, I did my video authentically as me, introduced myself as Lynette and that shined through, you know, together with the grace of God. Um, because at the end of the day, I usually give my thanks and my gratitude to God because I know that I cannot achieve anything in this life without um, God having planned it in my destiny. It's been amazing. I've been seeing your messages. I've been receiving your calls for a few friends. A few friends called, a few friends DM, a few friends message every time they see that. I'm on Facebook, on Instagram. I'm so thankful. I'm so thankful. Um, we are both or we are all celebrating together like me and you. We are still riding high on that good feeling because it's a big deal. It's a big deal to be a Kenyan model on a Nivea product. As regular as I am. A little old Queen Lean. <laughs> you know, <laughs> like I'm a proper village girl, man. Like, <laughs> I never thought that this thing would come true, but it just goes to show you that there's nothing that is too big for God. And 
once you have your focus and you believe in yourself and you are authentic and you operate from a good energy i feel like that is also important for me to add there you need to cultivate good energy within you it creates a ripple effect and it comes back to you so that's one thing i would say because for me whenever i work and um, whenever i'm on set i love to make sure that number one my client is satisfied my my fellow models are okay they are comfortable like we are all you know in synchronicity we are all understanding one another and supporting one another that's very much my vibe you know god is bigger and he will always take care of you and you know you do not need to worry about what your fellow human being has to say about your talent or your gift you just continue being who you are continue being authentic continue praying to god and put yourself in a in line with your success meaning if it's fashion that you're into keep doing fashion if it's hair that you're into keep doing hair if it's modeling you're into keep doing it and surely god is gonna make your dreams come true right before your eyes and when you least expect it that's the other thing i've seen that he comes in and does something when you least when nobody nobody saw that coming not even i and yet it did and it's here and every day seeing my face on social media and seeing ladies respond so well to this campaign is the biggest blessing in my heart and i want to encourage any other model out there not to lose hope it doesn't matter where you came from or what your life has been like um i'm someone who has gone through so many um challenges in life but i've fought through them and i still keep fighting and i'm i'm never going to stop fighting because i believe that when you know who you are then your will for life is always going to be greater than the challenges that you face so yeah it's been fun it's as random as that the story there was no big detail behind it it was well orchestrated by god himself and now we are here <laughs> and i thank god so much um yeah beauties but i wish everybody success in your modeling journey in your modeling career also let me know if you guys would want me to make an in-depth modeling um video just maybe sharing tips that have kept me going through the years and maybe advice that young models would love to hear from me maybe i don't know let me know in the comment section but until the next video beauties bye and remember to buy your nivea perfect and matte day cream and the wash okay tag me i want to see you or when you see my picture tag me at queen lynn and i'll be sure to repost all right beauties take care bye Mwah.